is your tired mechanic giving you a pro tip. Do you have a 5.7 liter Hemi with the multiple cylinder disabled? Other than replacing lifters for the rest of your life, you may want to prevent a problem of the cylinder shutdown solenoids, which you see here. When you have to pull them out, they tend to break and cause even more problems. And a lot of the times, pulling them out was a waste of your effort to begin with because you had a circuit code. So here's your wiring harness for your MDS solenoids. And good old Dodge, in their infinite cheap wisdom, decided to just lay that directly on the hot block. So what happens is it melts to the block and shorts the wiring harness out. And then somebody comes in to change the solenoids because you're already there, breaks them and drops little beads in your engine and you have problems for the rest of your life. So instead of dealing with that, if you ever have to take the intake off, which you probably will because this motor likes to crap lifters more than me eating at Taco Bell, take a little piece of nylon strap or a seat belt and slide it under every contact point before you jam your foam and intake back in here. And again, don't change those. You're welcome. Now, some people may tell you that this on the engine block could be a fire hazard. Tell them they're stupid. Get them out of your life. You don't need that type of negativity.